Guys, it's completely over for Gavi. He has reportedly suffered either an ACL injury or a really, really severe knee injury, which will see him out for the rest of the season. And before I actually go into just what a severe injury this is, let me just say this, right? Like, we're seeing these kinds of injuries happen so often nowadays. We saw Militao being out really early in the season due to a very severe injury. We saw, obviously, Courtois out um, because of an ACL, I think. And we're seeing a lot of these players just being out for a long period of time. But what I've noticed is, why are these managers playing key, key, key players in games that don't matter? Today, Spain did not have to actually play Gabi. They rested majority of the team. They rested literally 95% of the team. The only player that wasn't rested that could be considered a key player for Spain was, of course, Gabi. Literally, they won 3-1 against Georgia, which is a game that it doesn't even matter. Even if they won, even if they didn't you know, win, it would have made absolutely no significance into their actual standings. They're literally top of their group, a group A, and even if they lost, they would still be a point ahead of Scotland. So there's absolutely no reason for this Spanish manager to actually play Gavi. But what does he do? He plays a key player. And the pre-match press conference yesterday, he said that players like Gavi just never tire and they're just never going to like, you know, want to miss a game. And even if that is true somehow, as a manager with more experience and as a manager who's managed the youth levels of Spain, surely you have the knowledge to realize that you're not supposed to do that to key players. But of course, this doesn't exist with this manager. He's done this with Pedri. He did this with Pedri by taking him to the Olympics right after the Euros and right after a season where Kuman literally played him for like 50, 60 games. So if you talk about mismanagement in Barcelona, it's there from the top. We saw that with Pedri. We saw that even with Ansu Fati. His situation is different because his injury was completely different, but we did not rest him enough and we brought him back immediately. And this is the same problem once again.